The following is an Extreme Rules match. Making his way to the ring from Chicago, Illinois, weighing in at 228 pounds, CM Punk. Matches of this caliber with this level of talent showing their skills, this is why I do what I do. And his opponent, representing the tribe from the Isle of Samoa, weighing in at 275 pounds, Jacob Fox Yu. This is a competitor who has earned the adoration of the WWE Universe by defying authority figures and doing things their own way. Oh, no. In an Extreme Rules match, it's hard to predict what will happen, but there will be chaos. I can assure you of that. A thing I love about Extreme Rules is we're guaranteed something from out of the blue. Some outside interference, a weapon nobody saw coming. Oh, who are you kidding, Corey? You just love all this anarchy, don't you? Confession. Guilty as charged. Uh-oh. Able to get the advantage here. Both competitors showing how well they know one another. Oh, driver! Spiked him. And you don't just do something like that to win a match. You do that to inflict punishment. Into the corner he goes. A perfectly placed target. He's one step ahead there. Moves outside. What's the plan here? Settling on the kendo stick. No good can come from this. How did scouted? Kendo stick impact. Oh. And he's taking on a persistent assault. Yeah, and this has to decrease his composure moving forward. Given the no disqualification modifier on this match, Corey, what kind of tactics should you expect to see here? Ruthless tactics, Cole. Now is the time for these superstars to unleash their pent-up aggression and be as violent as they want. There's nothing the ref can do about it, so they should go all out. And he's taking this to the outside now. Stiff headbutt. Could be some collateral damage on the way here. Everyone needs to clear out, including us. He avoids the damage. The damage he's taken is starting to pile up. What a shot! Ooh. Oh! Oh! Every successive move is putting their opponent in a dicey situation. Well, this is a warning to grab our stuff and go. Keep it in the ring, please. Saxton's a very fragile boy. Big clothesline! And he tosses him back in now. He's setting it up on the ring apron right now. You've got to wonder what he has in mind here. Back in the ring now. No respect at all with that action. But it can also be meant to antagonize. Could be a method of luring your opponent into a mistake. Control. Catches a punch. And this one might be headed ringside. He leaves the ring and there's no count outs in this one. Oh, man. Uh -oh. Crafty way to get out of harm there. Up and down, what a gourd buster. Yeah. 
Suplexes, slams, and bombs are all painful, but being slapped like that is humiliating. You would know, Saxton. Fisherman suplex. He is delivering elbow after elbow. knee getting dangerously close to our desk that's it i'm out of here ah oh, this could be dangerous guys without a doubt from the top you gotta be kidding me and after that you know things have just kicked up a notch pedal to the metal right now well great Rearranging our ringside furniture here. Clearing the announce desk. What a mess. Scouted it and fired back with a punch straight to the face. Brilliant countering by both competitors. Pulls their opponent in. Belly to belly. Squaring off right by our announce table. I able to counter. Everyone needs to get out of the way of this fight. This feels so unsafe. Oh, my God, a pile driver. Lots of potential for injury here at ringside. These superstars better be careful. The floor, the barricades, our table. None of these things are fun to collide with. Oh, sharp knee. Oh. Kick right to the midsection. Put it in the corner now. The shining wizard action. And, oh, no, we don't need this right now. Sure we do. The more the merrier. These two are having a fantastic matchup. Oh, well, where is he? He just barely dodges. Oh, a knee. Lights out. And he's just flaunting his skills now. Oh, it's not going to be pretty. Go to sleep, GTS. Night, night. Big opportunity for him. Makes now. the cover. And a win. That may be one of the biggest wins of his career. Here is your winner, CM. I have to imagine things might have been different had this been a fully fair fight, but tonight we only have this. I don't see how you can say the distraction factor didn't play a factor in this one, guys. Yeah, they put up a good fight, but you have to imagine their head was not in the right place after that distraction. That's true, Saxon. It's hard to focus on just the match when there's an outside variable at play.